Okay, you ready to battle the dark cubes? Hope it's learned some new tricks. Yeah, now it's gotta face all of us. That's right. Freddy want to destroy! Our probability of success is... You don't have to crunch the numbers, Baymax. It's not the sum of our parts. It's the sum of our hearts. Yeah! <laughs> Which adds <sighs> up to what? <sighs> Show me. Almost there. What? <laughs> this pile of junk collected the data we needed. The terror of being attacked without warning. The despair of having no place to run. The longing for vengeance. A heart's more than that! It's working together! Why will it something funny? Trusting friends. In every heart, there's hope. Yeah. Yes! You're right. Huh? That's why I made sure our creation fought you. Now the data contains a complete heart. A heart made from conflict? That can't be what real! What was it you said? <clears throat> I only have to see it for it to become real. So, let's see it. First, we need a vessel. What's going on? Another dark cube form? Doesn't look as bad as the last one. <laughs> it could be a trick. Usually is. <laughs> yeah. Wait. That's Baymax. What? Oh. Huh? No way. Uh, <gasps> B-Max. Don't bother. This puppet has lost his heart. He won't wake up. He's not a puppet! B-Max, he's like my family. Please, give me back, my friend. <laughs> yes. Huh? I did promise I'd put this back where I found it. You're the one who's going to complete this heart. Yeah, right! You can't have a heart without sadness, without loss. You see, you're going to destroy Hero's friend, right in front of him. Wait! <laughs> uh, oh no! <laughs> Hero. Hero, tell us, what should we do? 
Baymax means everything to me. But that chip isn't who he is. I already made this mistake once before. Tadashi wouldn't want there to be a Baymax that hurts people. Sora? He has to be stopped. Okay. Help Gogo and the others. You can leave this guy to us. Thank you. <sighs> oh, ah! oh! oh no! Sora, take Baymax. Okay, Baymax! I am ready, Sora.
<laughs> Guys! <sighs> so, did we stop him? Safety mode kicks in if he's put under too much stress. So, he's probably just in stasis. We'll have to destroy the chip if we want to be certain. But... Are you sure? Yeah, dude. You don't need to go that far. Maybe we can find another way. Mm-mm. It's the right thing to do. Tadashi would have done the same thing. <sighs> but Hiro, isn't that Baymax's heart? Mm. That's okay. Baymax is here. I should be the one. Hello, I am Baymax, your personal healthcare companion. He's my personal healthcare companion. Huh? Hey, liking the look. <laughs> Cut your hair, too. Mm hmm. So, you gonna try yours on? Uh, I don't know. Maybe later. But you always wear the same thing. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. This is how you pick me out of a crowd. I make myself easy to remember. How thoughtful. Huh? Oh, nah, not really. <laughs> Our training's almost finished. Yeah. Somewhere inside me is Namine. If we can free Roxas, we can free her too. I guess so. Namine was made when Sora freed me from his heart. So, now that she's a part of me again, I figured all was right. But she can't look at this forest, feel the wind on her face, none of it. And if she could, it would be different for her. Her time was short, but she lived it, and that makes it hers. What right did I have to take those feelings and experiences back? They don't belong to me. Nothing's as it should be. Not for her or Roxas. I know. Way back when I was a kid, I met this other weird kid. Somehow we became fast friends. Never saw him again, nearly forgot about him too. Then I met Roxas couldn't believe it. 
The two of them were identical. Oh, I didn't tell Roxas. Didn't want him to go vanishing on me, too. The kid's name was Ventus. He's one of the lost Keyblade wielders we're looking for. Think he's still got me memorized? Oh yeah, very memorized. <laughs> now that we're going back, I'm worried about everything. Well, you don't have to worry alone anymore, Axel. It's about time! Hey, uh, shut uh, it! Uh, Come on! What now? Please, I have created enough victims. Yes, you have. All of the children sacrificed in the name of your research. So make things right. I told you I did not take her. Her disappearance was why I put us... You used Roxas and Namine and threw them away. I doubt there's a merciful bone in your body. You took the girl and hid her. Now show me the data you are hiding here. Roxas and Namine. If there is any reason that I still draw breath... It is to atone for what I did to them. <gasps> he said Roxas. Yeah. That man needs us. Right. Yeah. If you do find the girl, what is it that you expect will happen? The child's memory holds a mystery to unravel. One concerning the battle we seek between light and darkness. You know something, and that is why you stopped the experiments. 
You are completely deluded, Xehanort. We shall soon see. <clears throat> yoo <-hoo! clears throat> uh, uh, Excuse me! Who are you? Oh, well, I'm looking for a friend who used to live here. No one lives here. Be gone. Um, but, sir... No, 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 not one more step. Get out! Uh, this <clears throat> way! Oh. <clears throat> hey, loser! <clears throat> or not! Painter! <clears throat> <gasps> the squiggly uh... things? They protected me. Hayner, get a move on! Oh, okay. I serve the organization. This is treason. I see what is happening. Have it your way, then. Think. <sighs> Nobody knows the twists and turns of Twilight Town better than us. You are Roxas's friends. That's right. So you know him too? Oh yes, quite well. Pay dirt. Guess it was worth staking out the old mansion after all, because this guy here is what I call a lead. That's the only proof we have that Roxas was our friend. Tell us about him. We want to know him better. My dear master, <coughs> you are safe. Who's there? Evan, is that you? So, those nobodies were your doing. I have been waiting for this. Gave up a normal life in order to plant myself in the organization. And when I heard Xehanort had gone looking for you, I realized it was my chance to find you as well. For you see, I too wish to atone. Mm.
see. For me, the, the Kraken left from the ocean bright Look out, me heart is your woe And to the locker the sparrow can find Look out, me heart is your woe Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me A goddess thought she a sparrow safe Look out, me heart is your woe and brought a blackguard back from the grave. Look out, me heart is yo ho. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. The flying Dutchman is on the hunt. Look out, me heart is yo ho. To punish a sparrow for his affront. Look out, me heart is yo ho. Yo ho, yo ho. For me, within the chest his secret sleeps. Look out, me heart is your hoe. The heart of David Jones still beats. Look out, me heart is your hoe. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. <laughs> Why are you so happy? Because we get to be pirates again. Yep, you always did like this world. How could anyone not? Still, it's a real shame we don't have a bigger ship. Got any idea where we're going? Where else? The edge of the world! Captain Sora! Oh? What ails ya, Mr. Goofy? The edge of the world! Aye! We're running out of sea, sir! Aye! We're running out of sea! <laughs> oh? Running out? We end up this time. We've been walking forever. I'm exhausted. Some pirates. We won't get anywhere without a ship. Hmm? A ship? Oh boy! 
Bye. It is a ship. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Sora. Huh? Oh, Jack Sparrow! <sighs> Captain Jack Sparrow. Sure is. <laughs> hey, Jack, where are we? Oh. Belay that ship absconding! Huh? Help me catch the pearl before she gets away! <laughs> aye, aye, Captain. Mr. Gibbs! Aye, Captain. I thought so. I expect you're able to account for your actions, then. Sir? There's been a perpetual and virulent lack of discipline upon my vessel. Why? Sir, you're... You're in Davy Jones' locker, Captain. Hmm? Davy Jones' locker? I know that. I know where I am. And don't think I don't. I'm in Davy Jones' locker. Assuredly. Oh, Jack Sparrow. 
Barbosa! Oh. Ah, Hector! It's been too long, hasn't it? Aye, Illa de Muerta, remember? You shot me. No, I didn't. Sora, we meet again. Huh? It's lovely to see you all. Oh, Will! Elizabeth! Is something about you different? Yeah, you look all swashbuckly. Well, I've seen some adventures. But I never thought I'd find you here. Speaking of, where exactly is here? What's all this about a locker? Davy Jones' locker. Jack neglected to repay a certain debt to Jones. So Jones sent the Kraken to devour Jack. And that's how he ended up here. Uh. Then... Davy Jones' locker? You're saying that we've gone beyond... Beyond the grave? Mm. And we're here to rest Jack from his fate. Theodore, out and about, eh? You had an agreeable sense of the macabre to any delirium. <laughs> he thinks we're a hallucination. <laughs> Complete with these three masqueraders. Jack, this is real. We're here. We've come to rescue you. Huh? Have you now? That's very kind of you. But it would seem that as I possess a ship and you don't, you're the ones in need of rescuing. And I'm not sure as I'm in the mood. Jack! Cutler Beckett has the heart of Davy Jones. He controls the Flying Dutchman. He's taking over the seas. And he must be stopped. The Brethren caught his cald. Leave you people alone for just a minute. Look what happens. Everything's gone to pot. Hmm? I'm lost. What's going on? Well, um, sounds to me like this Beckett fella they mentioned is trying to conquer the ocean. Oh. But she wants to love you, Wanda. Yeah, no conquerors. Yeah. Listen, Jack, the world needs you back something fierce. And you need a crew. Why should I sail with any of you? Four of you have tried to annihilate me. Jack, we're on your side. Uh, so you are, mates. I never could have caught the pill without you. Sora, Donald, Goofy, you're hired. Yes! Now, as for the rest of you... Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Teodolma, you're in. Gibbs, you can come. <laughs> Way anchor, all hands. Prepare to make sail. Jack, which way you going, Jack? <laughs> right then, Mr. Sora, the helm is yours, provided no. you oh. pass muster. Huh? See that island there, with the two peaks? Prove you can reach that. And the open sea is yours. Oh. <laughs> aye, aye. Jack said to head for the island straight in front of us. on those ships. Ready the cannons. So... We do have a destination, right? 
Oh, I can't tell anymore. Stop it, stop making it up! Hmm. 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 <laughs> Cast your fate with Jack Sparrow, and you'll soon be sharing in the wrath of David Jones. The guy Will mentioned? Who does he think he is, anyway? And what did Jack ever do to him? Truly. You don't know who David Jones be, and you say you be men of the sea. D um, let's put it this way. We're from another sea. Hmm, are you now? Jack and David Jones' fate be intertwined. Jones, him raise Jack's precious pearl from the depths and make Jack captain for 13 years. In exchange, Jack promised to give Jones him soul as payment. But 13 years pass. And Jack failed to return. <laughs> so Jones, him seen the kraken to devour Jack, taking him and the pearl back to the depths. But, if Jones learn that witty Jack cheat that fate, him gonna punish Jack even worse. And Jack's friends, too. Oh. Are you, um, talking about us? You mean that the Kraken's gonna eat us? Uh, let the Kraken have a crack. I ain't scared. Hmm, not scared at all. That be rare. Most men, dim run for land at the mention of the Kraken. Not you. But Jack be scared. He want to be free of his debt to David Jones. That's why him need the box. Box? Oh, it be a chest. Where David Jones lock away the part of him that hurt. The pain it caused him was too much to live with, but not enough to cause him to die. Oh. And what part of him is that? <laughs> him hard. How does he do it? A creature absent a heart, and yet somehow able to keep existing. Not even my finest replica can claim that achievement. The secret must be in that box. I have to know what mysteries it contains. I believe our orders were to find the box and seize it. No more. Put a leash on that runaway curiosity. Always so short-sighted. Why would the organization seek me out just as soon as I was re-completed, if not to affirm my intellectual prowess and invest in my research? Every stride I make is a stride for all of us. Oh, really? And what exactly are we striding towards? Hmm? Luxord. Do I detect a hint of treachery in your words? What? Don't be absurd. But to be clear, I serve the organization. I don't share your need to please Xemnas. He's good at wrapping you around his little finger. Always has been. Hmm. All I desire is the freedom to continue my research. Ansem the Wise refused to nurture my talents, so I cast my lot with Xemnas. With Xehanort, rather. Simple as that. I see. And you don't care how he uses your research? Not in the slightest. All that concerns me is that I complete the perfect human vessel. Mm -hmm. That's all well and good. 
but I know this world better than you. Kindly stay out of the way. Oh, of course. Considering those pests have shown up, I'd hardly get anything done. I already know what to do with the pests. Then you can resume your stuffy studies. Ah, that's my boy. I'll be watching from the shadows then. Thanks, Jack. You could have warned us. Yeah, everything went topsy turvy and upsy downsy. Well, at least we're back in the land of the living. Never fear. All according to plan. But that be no reason to rest easy. Huh? A ship! I've never seen one like that. <gasps> Heartless! Have you aligned with those fiends again? Don't impugn me, Honor. Why would I conspire with them? But you did conspire with them. Could you discuss it later? Oh. Huh? <laughs> Get ready! <sighs> hmm. I sure do wish we could get a little closer. What? What a war! We can't do that! <gasps> we can! <laughs> Donald and Goofy! Protect the ship! I'll handle the Heartless! <laughs> the others after you fell we came looking for you I guess they must have kept going oh and I was so happy that we got to see them again that's eager to sail under Captain Jack Sparrow oh? Jack Thank you. 
Perhaps you'll consider an arrangement, one which requires nothing from you. In exchange for fair compensation, square my debt with Jones, guarantee my freedom. Of course, it's just good business. Were I in a divulgatory mood, what then might I divulge? Everything. Where are they meeting? What are their plans? Shall we? Shall we what? Some pirate won't get anywhere without a ship. So, let's go get one. Oh... <laughs> yes! <laughs> Sora and Jack sure are cut from the same cloth. Use that key to free me, Sora, and you have my most certain promise. I'll the power under sea you ever wish for, be yours. Free her... how? What's wrong? Huh? Oh, nothing really. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> 